Hello and welcome to Cordy's Auction House. The items shown in this video come from the auction of the 16th of July 2013. This sale hosts the second part of the Redmond collection of the Royal Dalton which we see here. Mr Redmond was a milk vendor in Christchurch who used his spare money to collect these cherished items. Showing in the cabinet is the best collection of Royal Dalton Blue Children China we have ever had at Cordy's. It includes vases and a massive charger in the Past Times series. The blue vase shown on the top shelf is one of the rarest in the auction. A Royal Dalton showing a hand-painted scene from Mount Cook and the Hooker Glacier, signed by Leonard Bentley. To find New Zealand scenes is very rare and this item could achieve up to $15,000 at auction. This is a major piece of Royal Dalton Changware, the largest piece we've ever had at auction at Cordy's. This example could go for three and a half to five thousand dollars. We have a good selection of Japanese china. Showing in this cabinet is a selection of oriental items, including a good selection of ivory and Chinese silver. Here we have a collection of Hannah Barlow wares, the large vase at the back is a combination of Hannah Barlow and Frank Butler. In this corner, we have a great selection of taxidermy, some of it displayed in the vintage Avery. We also see a selection of wingback chairs, large mirrors, Persian rugs, chandeliers and a Chinese vase. We have four finely painted watercolours of native New Zealand birds following through to the sailing ship by Joseph Craig, which has historical significance to this country, as well as a variety of paintings by other New Zealand artists. Displayed on the chest is a magnificent late 17th century French clock made in the Oriental style. In this sale we have a good selection of Victorian and Edwardian cabinets and chests of drawers. We have two large antique elephant tusks expected to fetch from five to seven thousand dollars each. We have a 19th century French mantel clock surmounted by a bronze lion estimated to sell at four to six thousand dollars. The paintings shown here are by W.G. Baker of Lake Pukaki and the Manawatu Gorge and they could achieve two thousand dollars each. The large vase shown here is by Auckland glassmaker Gary Nash. In the cabinets we have a fine selection of English 18th and 19th century silver. On this shelf we have a fine Russian icon, a good selection of antique portrait miniatures and a selection of pocket and wristwatches including an 18 carat 1920s Rolex Oyster. The jade walrus at the front of the cabinet is possibly a Fabergé example. On the lower shelf we have a selection of 19th century French carriage clocks and Japanese short swords. Showing above our door is a blue wildebeest, a paradise duck, a hawk and a golden pheasant. In this auction we have five French gilt armchairs plus a selection of dining tables. This is a 19th century Chinese traveling medicine cabinet. Each of the multiple drawers inside is labeled with a long drawer at the top and as you can see it folds in half. See our website for details of our upcoming auctions and to sign up for our mailing list.